Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, where we finally got onto this roof. You will not believe how long it fucking took me. It took me about 15 minutes, actually. Um. Uh, there we go. Oh, oh, getting there. And unlocked. Let me pick up the coffee. There we go. There we go. Gazi. Shh. The movie is on. Mama's watching. Is Mama happy? Yeah. Mama's real happy. Gazi got her chocolates and a movie. Well, then I'm gonna take some medicine to help my friend. Well, okay. Oh, Mama stopped getting seizures. What? <laughs> Tending to a pumpkin. They're on the table. <laughs> Yeah, thanks, Gazi. Gazi um, make everybody happy. Oh. Okay. Really, I've got to leave for the roof. Take the medicine back to Lina. I'm not going for the upgrade just yet. Uh, got some flares. Nice. 58, 35, 36, 26. There we go. Get rid of that. Wow, that really was easy.
Here we go. It's really easy to get yourself lost around here. I don't know. It's, it's, it's a fairly large area, I suppose. So a train comes out of nowhere and just goes, Surprise, motherfucker! Sorry, I know I'm not really talking much, guys, but most of the time I am just like, focusing on the game. <laughs> there we go. Sorry, zombies. Take the elevator back up. Uh, take the medication back to Brooklyn. Hope he's okay. Strange, someone like Garzy can survive out there. I guess the trick is understand your limitations or work within them. Maybe Brecken doesn't know his. Hope you. Hope to hell I know mine. Okay. You know, I do need to find some better weapons soon. All of mine are blunt weapons. I need something sharp that I can decapitate. Right, I've got your anti-seizure medicine. Thanks. Oh, how'd things go with Gazi? Well, he may be challenged, but he's very good at getting what he wants. Did you meet his mom? Yeah, she seemed happy. If mama ain't happy, ain't nobody happy. Speaking of which, Brecken asked me to pass this on to you, with his thanks. Good work taking out that anti-zin line. Yes. You've saved a lot of lives. Now it's only a matter of time before someone starts another one. Oh yeah, because we completed the, an the um, danger fake drug one the other, empty other episode as well, didn't we? Out there. People throw them away, and then anyone can refill them with whatever they like. You better start destroying them. We've collected all the bottles in the tower. Plus, Brecken is offering a $10 bounty Ooh. for every bottle you runners find out there. Sweet. Uh, 
quests. Explore the quarantine zone. The old railroad facility is abandoned. Railroad depot. Dallas. Okay. Um, I think I'll wait a while for that one. How's the pain? Whoa. Oh, sorry, mate. Actually, hang on. Let's go to my inventory. Right, so that's 40. 36, get rid of that. 58, that's good. Keep that one. Make another two med kits. And some Molotovs. Right. Let's go report the airdrop. Or report the GM, contact the GRE. With most of the runners out of action, Brecken wants the scouts to take their place. That means me. We're supposed to go for the next airdrop right before sunset. Jade will be showing me the ropes. Yeah, that won't be awkward at all. stupidity of a landing spot at the beginning of the game got you infected and got her brother killed. What you got? Yeah, let's buy that. Oh, baseball bat. Uh, oh, they're nice. But I don't have enough money for them. I do have a know how to craft quite a few more Sometimes stuff now. So. Like quite a outside. few more stuff. I eat English good. is named Brecken and he's definitely not your man. The other likely suspect is this warlord, basically. Local guy. Calls himself Rise. He's hoarding Antizen and then gouging the hell out of anybody who wants to buy some. I'm on a mission to get Antizen from the airdrop. If I don't succeed, they'll have to come up with something else. Acknowledged. Good job, Crane. You're doing well. Stay on task and we'll be in touch. Be sure to call us immediately if and when you get that Antizen. Right.
I'm glad he doesn't do like an evil within sort of thing where he just like stops. So you can keep moving just very slowly. Close to the drop zone. Good. Find some shelter and wait. Most of the drops seem to fall exactly in that area. There's a crate. It looks intact. I'll check out what's inside. Come on, climb the building. <laughs> Climb, 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 climb. There we go. Oh, I know this isn't the one I'm supposed to go for, but... There we go.
Fill yourself up, come on. Excuse me, coming through. Shit, too late. Jade Rice's men got here first. Don't try to find them. Just find the second one. Look for the I'm almost there. I can do this. Crane here. I'm about to recover an antizen drop. Good, Crane. This offers us a new strategy. Time to turn your attention to Rise. Listen closely. It's very possible that Rise is our man. So if you find an airdrop okay. containing antizen, destroy it. What? 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 Why? It will force interaction with Rise. You can go under Brecken's auspices as an ambassador, if you will. But, but there are civilians depending on this stuff. Our plan is focused on the greater good. Remember that. Shit. Jade, I'm at the airdrop. There's no answers in here. Done? Fuck! Fuck! All right. Get back here and be careful. The nightmares are awake. Don't let them see. The nightmares? Oh, shit. They must have heard me. Oh, fuck. What the fuck is that? Run, run, run.
Maybe that. Come on. Come on. Run. Jesus Christ. <sighs> and I think that's a pretty good place to end the episode, guys. Hope you're still enjoying it. Leave us a like and subscribe if you if you are, and I will see you next time. Adios.